Are you a middle school math teacher struggling to make teaching area and perimeter fun and engaging in your middle school math class? If we don't already know each other, my name is Kathy Martin and I'm the creator of the Pre-Algebra Teachers Middle School Math Membership. We are your one-stop shop for everything you need to teach 6th, 7th, and 8th grade math. Hit that like button if you are like me and struggled as a student with learning geometry concepts. I hope I'm not the only one. <laughs> Because I struggled so hard when I was younger, like in eighth grade, in algebra one, with learning geometry concepts, teaching these geometry concepts has, is not always easy for me because it's not something I always fully, fully understand. So I don't really always feel confident in teaching like these, you know, these um, area perimeter circumference concepts, but it's okay. We are always a work in progress and we are always trying to be better, right? So again, if you are like me, feel free to hit that like button so that I know I'm not alone um, when struggle, when having some of these struggles. In today's video, I'm going to share with you one of my newest activities to make area and perimeter a little bit more fun, a little bit more engaging, and a little bit more real life. I know for me personally, sometimes I think to myself, when do I, when do I ever really use area and perimeter in life? Well, it happens a lot more than you think. And in this resource, your students are going to work together with the town mayor and bring a care or bring a carnival to their town. So let's dive right into this resource. Hooray, the carnival is coming. Okay, not really, but in this resource it is. Your students are going to help the mayor again, determine if all of the attractions will fit in the open field behind the town hall. They have to determine if it'll fit comfortably so that people in town can walk around the carnival easily and comfortably. So using the following pages, students will, um, they will have dimensions of each attraction. They will have to use those dimensions to place all of the attractions on the map of the town hall. So you can see here, this page has all of these dimensions of all of the attractions, and it includes carousel, bumper cars, the swings, Ferris wheel, cotton candy stand, popcorn stand, lucky ducks, and ring toss. It has all the dimensions on this page. And on the following page is the field, and students will have to cut out each of these um, attractions and place them on the sheet. The following page is a formula sheet, with all the information that they need to solve area perimeter and perimeter of a circle. And then there's also some review questions with um, an answer key because you don't have time to create your own answers. If you are already a member of the Pre-Algebra Teachers Math Membership, you already have access to this resource. If you would like to learn more about the Pre-Algebra Teachers Membership, check out the video linked to this video, and you will get a behind the scenes look of exactly what it's like to be inside of the membership right here. Again, you can grab this resource to use in your classroom today using the description box below, and I look forward to seeing you next time. Bye.